That's what crazy. did you do with the reunion? Are, are you allowed to? Yeah, we you know it's weird. I mean, I, I told them I, I'm not going to really shit on them, but it was a really bad experience in terms of <laughs> it wasn't the same crew at all. It was this new mm-hmm. crew, and they just first of all they flew was me it out. Crew? It's a, for was e. it like- it's going to be on E, not on Bravo. Same. They own the same. This company owns both networks. You know, um, Bravo and E mm-hmm. owned by the same company. But um, so they flew me out. I was there for two days. They realized they made a mistake. They couldn't film that weekend. They flew me home. I waited five days and then flew back again. Uh, I waited in my hotel room. Everything's quarantine nonsense. So I had to get tested yeah. before I leave, tested when I land, wait 24 hours, get tested again, couldn't leave the hotel. There's all these like, you know, um, fail safes put in place for COVID, which I totally get, but I just had to do it twice, which was annoying. And then when I went to film, that day, they had me get there by 11.30 in the morning. They picked me up. Well, very nice. But I sat in a room by myself for six hours uh, with no internet, no television, nothing, no way to power my phone. So I couldn't even surf. The, you know, I couldn't even use my phone because I didn't have any charger. I didn't know I'd be there. And I finally started filming at like six at night, which is weird. I just sat in a room by myself forever. It was really, really hard to stay uh, focused. Yeah. It was really ridiculous. And then I think realistically i shot 10 minutes worth of stuff they didn't they told me they'd buy me a lot of clothes they bought me no clothes they were gonna <laughs> give me a haircut they didn't give me a haircut they told me they were gonna get me like uh hair and makeup shit they didn't do any of that i just was there it was a really the cast themselves the queer t- eye guys almost left because there was so much chaos on set nothing would like it was crazy so i don't even know if it'll come out but i did shoot it but it was probably <laughs> Look, I've only done maybe 10 TV shows in my life at most, uh, and it was the worst handled uh, television experience of my life. This motherfucker is That crazy. sounds horrible. Yeah, maybe they were crazy. trying to like make it everyone really frustrated, so it was like a high, tense, uh, but no, maybe, it just sounds like... I don't know. I just, just feel like... they. So, like, just to give you one example, we're finally filming. They're going through my suitcase. They pick out some stuff, and then Carson says, you know what would look great with this? A really cool jacket. And they had told me ahead of time, Carson picked out these amazing, like, $1,000 great rock and roll blazers for you. You're going to love them. And it's while we're filming, and they stop and go, wait a minute. Yeah, we didn't get to buy him that. So we had to stop because we didn't have it. So we shot it. We started shooting again. And then he goes, oh, I guess those jackets, that'll work. Without a, wish you had a jacket, but whatever. And then they give me Kyan. And Kyan says, you know, let's get you a haircut so you look cool for the night because we're doing it. And they go, stop. Yeah, we don't have time to get him a haircut. I, it was almost seemed like it was a joke. It was crazy. <laughs> but, uh, you know, whatever. We, I, I'm glad to, that they even brought me out. It was fun. To, and I got to get free food and a trip in L, to L.A. for a few days. Even if I was on lockdown, it was a cool hotel. Trips to L.A. Yeah, two trips to L.A. Uh, I stayed at the London, which is like a really cool hotel in, uh, in L.A. And I just basically sat at the pool for five days and then was used one day and went home. That's nice. Yeah. Did they knew? Who, did they knew who you were? Like, or were they just like, "Oh fuck, this guy like has well, a way the, to." The queer eye guys. It was all the old original guys. They all remembered me. You know that that team did. And I think that the staff probably the prerequisite was to watch that episode because they did seem to be familiar with who I was. I'm I'm imagining it wasn't part of their uh, educational experiences such as yours was, but it was a. Uh, they probably had to watch it before. You know what I'm saying? I'm I so down with your shit. Me. You know what I'm saying? Keeping it real. I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. It, was, it, was, it was fun. You know, but uh, I just, I don't think it's going to come out. I'll be shocked if it comes out. Oh, sorry. I'll be shocked if it comes out because I think we shot five minutes of material at most. And that's being kind. But maybe yeah, they shot it.